The inspiration for the uh, cover for the Synchronicity album is, was quite interesting. As it happens, I was the one of the three of us that was very into photography and obsessed with it, in fact. And I, I had quite a lot of contact with art photographers in New York, particularly Ralph Gibson. But I also was friends with R Dwayne Michaels. I suggested to the art director at a and in Los Angeles, how about Dwayne Michaels? So he immediately went for that idea and Dwayne got the gig with the world's number one band. The thing about making the Synchronicity album is that we were all gonna shoot with the one photographer, Dwayne, but we weren't gonna know what each of the other two did. So every guy would come up with his own ideas and do that. And uh, so that was really quite an interesting concept. And we weren't gonna see the album until the day it was released. Then we'd find out what the other two bastards did. That's the way it went. So I had an interesting experience with Dwayne. I had this idea about, you know, like sort of standing there with butterflies all flowing around my head, butterflies. We had to order butterflies. Where'd you get butterflies from? Well, they came from Florida and they came up to New York in cardboard boxes and they were frozen. We got this room that Dwayne had rented. We tried to put the heat on and open the boxes and there were the butterflies laying out in rows. They were all sort of semi-dead, not alive, but sort of, existing and we were hoping that the heat in the room would bring them back to life and they would fly all around it didn't work they were kind of oh god what are we doing here we were in Florida. so we ended up with me standing against the wall and, and sticking these butterflies all around me and putting them on my head and face and sort of throwing them in the air just hoping that they'd go, they would get fly you're a butterfly but we ended up putting the butterflies back in the boxes and we drove back into new york city and the end of it all is that Dwayne and I got out, walked into uh, the park, Central Park, and sort of threw the butterflies around in the bushes and the grass, hoping that they would realize that they were in their own habitat. Dwayne was great to, to work with. Came up with a very sort of interesting Dwayne Michaels take on things. I have all his books, and I, I was very into his stuff before we ever met him. So for me, it was great to meet with him, because he was a very nice man to work with too.